Hi, I'm Jackie Lawbacker with Two Thumbs Up Training. Okay, so we're going to talk about pet consent. What is that? Well, it's exactly what it sounds like. It's a pet giving you consent to touch them and pet them. So it's not something that we think all the time because when a dog approaches us, we feel like we have the right to go ahead and just pet the dog because we're friendly and we want to love on the dog. The problem is, is that dogs don't always see it that way. So what we're gonna do is to talk about like how you can see whether your dog is giving you that consent, that permission to go ahead and pet them. So we apply the two to three second rule, which means if a dog approaches you, you're going to read the dog to know whether it is interested in staying with you and being petted or not. So dog approaches me, I am gonna put my hand down. If the dog is looking loose, his body is swaying, his tail is really loose and wiggly, I'm gonna go ahead and just scratch him underneath his chin by his ear, back of ear. I'm gonna do that for about two or three seconds and then I'm gonna take my hand away. If the dog stays there, he's giving me permission to say, I'm okay with you touching me more. So I'm gonna do just that. I'm gonna reach down and I'm going to scratch him again. Again, I'm gonna do two to three seconds, take my hand away. If he totally turns and leans on me, he is giving me full permission to go ahead and love on him. So I'm gonna do just that and I'm gonna gently stroke him on his side. Not a lot, again, two to three seconds. If he stays, you're golden. If he moves away just out of reach, like some dogs do, you're gonna to try to reach over and touch them. No, no, you're gonna give them that space. He's putting himself at that distance because he wants to be close, but he doesn't want you touching him anymore. So we're gonna respect his space. And this is him giving us permission or not, or taking it away. And we are going to respect that. How you touch them is also another, another way that you have to think about. Most of the time when dogs approach us, we go right for over the top of the head and we scratch. Some dogs, if you notice, they start to duck a little bit. Well, us having our hands coming over a dog can be very, very intrusive and can be a little scary for some dogs. So think about when you're petting them to go ahead and maybe go to their sides, go to their side of their body, go behind underneath their ears so that you don't have to go over their head. And again, listen to what they're telling you. If they move away, they're saying, no more, please don't touch me. We're gonna respect that. So remember, pet consent. You get two to three seconds to go ahead and pet that dog. If he's staying with you, you're golden. If he moves away, just go ahead and give him his space. And that's your tip of the day for pet consent.